A ballista was in effect a huge crossbow that could be loaded with heavy bolts and stones and would be used to disable and destroy enemy armaments or even to inflict huge casualties against opposition troops. They were made up of a ramp upon which the projectile was loaded and a heavy-duty string that was attached to a spring-loaded lever on either side. The projectile was pulled back to create tension on the levers, and when it was released, they would propel it forwards. The Greeks were the first civilization known to use a ballista-like device and believed to have used them on the battlefield as early as 400 BC. They also became a mainstay of the Roman military force and were deployed across Europe to help them capture and defend new territories. They could, however, require a higher level of engineering ability than other weapons, so following the fall of the Roman Empire, their use faded away in favor of simpler designs. Even in the 19th century, when designs of ballistae and remnants of ones from ancient battlefields were found, researchers were unable to recreate them or understand how they functioned as weapons. It was only in the 20th century that modern engineering had caught up enough to make sense of them. Learn how much of an impact these devices would have made during battle. They're one example of how the Romans out-engineered their opposition as much as they outfought them with military training and tactics and without ballast. They wouldn't have been anywhere near as dominant a force. Subscribe for more videos like this and turn on the notification to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.